Game Industrial is here. Grandia 2. This is definitely not an intro I typically use like Holster for comms. Sure, we'll go with that. And it's us two. Again. <laughs> Once again. Because Celtics Internet's acting like crap and. Uh. We don't know where Kevin's at, so. The hell's wrong with him? Apparently, Ryudo has quite a nasty past here. Jeez. Did it really hate him that much? To be explained throughout the video, I think. Uh, I guess so. Yikes. And there was so much hate. I'll just sh just shut. I want them safer tonight, night, alright, you jerk? Gosh. Oh, you're such an ass. <laughs> Well, so much for staying in for the night. Just got booted out just like that. Oh, fuck you. Seriously, those roofs look like nipples. <sighs> Jeez Louise. Mm, that was a that was a transition right there. Oh, okay. I didn't just walk into the door and then immediately leave out. Okay, I gotcha. I'll let it go already. Do you want me to stick my beast man on you? <laughs> and my robot? And the <sighs> church girl? <laughs> and the robot. <laughs> and while we're here, my bird. <laughs> Someone just said that, they're not even quoting the f hell. Did you say Belfis? Yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was. are you doing over there, village chief? Well, make it your guy's mind. <laughs> are you gonna speak to you or not? You just gotta turn around and such. Uh, which way was my home? <laughs> was it that way? I knew I should have took the left to Albuquerque. Oh, damn it. <laughs> Oh, no, no, I should have took the right turn, Albuquerque. That's right. Damn it, Bucks. <laughs> Bucks did make the right turn, Albuquerque. <laughs> Seriously, what are we talking about? Why do these damn roofs... Why do these roofs have to be, like, freaking damn boobs? <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, okay. So now we're back to Ryudo and Elena again. Normally that ha when that happens, there's going to be another romantic moment. Okay. That would make sense. Calm yourself, Ryudo. Just calm down. But I just went to the inn. That oh shit. Dude, we just fought him. The four of us fought him, and we they kind of their ass kid. You think you can be him by yourself? I hardly doubt that. Uh, oh shit! <gasps> Where'd that cliff come from? Seriously? Do you just oh? 
I thought for saying he actually killed him for me, like, what the hell, you know? But, okay. I know he's trying to defend himself, but gosh. That sort of makes sense. If you don't know it by now, Melfis is the horns of has the horns of Almar. Oh, okay. Our next piece of Almar then. And it's sad. I'm guessing that's the. F I must see the fifth piece then we're after. Uh, let's see. Wings, tongue, eye, claw. Yeah, it'd be the fifth. Okay, so horns is the fifth piece. And we know about the heart, which is um, the sixth. But is it the sixth? There might be another one we could fight before the heart. That's true. Oh, I'm sure the heart will be last. I just don't know how many others are there after the horns. To be honest, the heart is not last. Oh, really? Okay, so there is one more after that. Okay. But I won't go into detail about that. You'll just have to wait. Yeah, that's fine. Rather keep it interesting as uh, we go through the playthrough some more. Indeed, because we still got 26 more parts to go. Yeah, a lot. We're now just halfway through all these videos that you finally uh, uploaded. We're, li we're literally at the halfway. We're literally at the halfway point now, people. We're not joking. We're, we're just we just passed the halfway mark. I don't remember when we started on this. Wasn't this like around uh? I wonder what happened to Ryudo. August, July, even I don't know. We started on. Uh. Something like that. It's been a while. <laughs> Slowly having a hard time getting into it at first, but yeah, now it's really getting very interesting. Okay, what's going on? Miss, do you really want to know what happened to Rio? Crispy m ms are back. Oh, damn it. <laughs> do not look outside. Look and I will leave. One more thing. Do not repeat this to anyone. Oh. Understand? Elena, you All tell right. me you don't know Sky's voice. Just tell me. <laughs> what happened? Well, that's actually Sky talking? I didn't know that. It's been a while since I heard him. Okay, now we can no learn the truth. Swordsman. This is where men came to polish their skills and pursue the way of the sword. Melfish and Ryudo were raised by the village chief uh, after they be right lost back. their parents when okay. they were young. The two began combat training and soon showed incredible progress. Melfish in particular became the greatest swordsman the village had ever <sighs> seen. Service is good. Boobs. <laughs> Boobs everywhere. <laughs> Damn it, I'm late BS over. Look at those the roof on those houses that look like boobs. <laughs> Sorry, everybody. <laughs> Gotta search the tree. Ryudo spent all day, every day, practicing with his best friend, Gata. Let's see, they are good friends. Okay. That's good to know. I must see Melphus holding in the background. I'm back. Melphus Welcome back. for being the strongest swordsman in the village. Shh. 
show off. <laughs> they both look so mad. It was like God was really angry over there. It was like he wants to be he wants to be just as strong as he is. Eventually, Melfus became engaged to the village chief's daughter, Rena. Okay. The good-natured Rena was already like a sister to Ryudo. Like this sword without a cloud, like this blade pure and true, we, we shall, shall become, become swordsmen, swordsmen, strong of heart. They really did care about each other until, I guess, in uh, those horns of Valmar changed them. Then, one day, a terrible storm beset the village. sword of such terrible power that it could only be wielded by the most powerful swordsman in the world. The sword was believed to protect the village from harm. Oh, uh, really now? Interesting. Rina went to the altar to quiet the angry idol. Means that I was raining on that one spot and not raining on them. That's very odd, yeah. <laughs> the strange rumblings did not cease. No! no one knew what happened to Rena. Thus began a terrible tragedy. Oh, great. When Rena did not come back, the worried village chief sent Melfus and a few other villagers to investigate. <laughs> Yet the storm and rumblings only grew worse. story short, bad things happened. Yeah, that makes sense. Ryudo silently chilled Melfus. Makes sense he would. He wanted to help his brother out. What? We by chance recognize that picture from when we first saw Melfus. Oh yeah, I see that. You you killed me. What the hell? 
You were gonna marry her, and you kill her instead. Tears in your anger. You killed her. What the hell, man? Star Wars reference. Oh. <laughs> kind of sounded familiar. Just couldn't think of it. The grief. What a mess. So much chaos. at the side of the dead Rina. Her body lay as it were, impaled upon the sword of Melphis. The villagers searched the island, but found neither hide nor hair of Melphis. Murderer, idol thief. This is how Melphis was now known. Because of his brother, Ryudo could no longer live in the village. So he came to live as a geohound. That was about three years ago. So up until now, Ryudo has lived bearing his own sorrow like that. Betrayed by the brother he trusted most, he became leery of ever trusting anyone again. Oh, it must have been hard. And that explains his behavior at the beginning of the game. Living all alone. <sighs> Poor thing. Yeah, exactly. Your understanding that will make it all much easier on him. Poor Yudo. That is deep. That's real deep. But now we know the truth. Grail Mountain. I guess that's our... Next destination. Yep. Tell me the thumbnail on the next part. I'm guessing that's it. And yeah, for lucky, he will kick uh, Melphus's ass. Maybe. Yeah, I'll have to see the next part of uh, Grandia 2. That was rough, but yeah, I guess we'll see you guys in the next part. Indeed. Later, peoples. Later.